Harry Potter Wizards Unite infuriates me. Now don't get me wrong, Harry Potter Wizards Unite is not a bad game. In fact, I would consider it a really great game. Niantic really hit it out of the park with Harry Potter Wizards Unite. I really love this game, I've been enjoying my time with it, and there's a lot of things that Harry Potter Wizards Unite is doing right that Pokemon Go is lacking. And that is precisely why I'm so mad about this game. One of the first things I noticed about Harry Potter Wizards Unite the moment I started playing it was that there were so many things in Harry Potter Wizards Unite that I really wanted for Pokemon Go, that a lot of people wanted for Pokemon Go. For what seems like forever, people have been asking for a lot of different improvements to Pokemon Go that would drastically improve the player experience. And for the longest time, those desires have seemingly gone unheard. Niantic hasn't implemented a lot of these small changes that players really wanted. And then comes Harry Potter Wizards Unite, and I see a lot of these desired mechanics currently in this game. It's really frustrating. I would love to give Niantic the benefit of the doubt and believe that a lot of the stuff that we're seeing in Harry Potter Wizards Unite will translate over to Pokemon Go eventually, but it is disheartening to see a lot of these mechanics in Harry Potter Wizards Unite as opposed to Pokemon Go, which in my opinion should be Niantic's cash cow. I can totally understand that Niantic would want to focus on the new game first, they really want to push it out and make it as good as it can be before it's released, but for Pokemon Go players, I can understand why we would be frustrated, mainly because a lot of these mechanics would drastically improve Pokemon Go, and we would love to see them in Pokemon Go eventually. What's happening everyone? It's me, it's Count, here with an all new video essay. Today I wanted to talk about Harry Potter Wizards Unite, more specifically what Harry Potter Wizards Unite is doing that Pokemon Go is not. So this is more of a Pokemon Go related video, even though the title suggests that it's all about Harry Potter Wizards Unite, it actually isn't. And I really hope that this video will actually put the message out there that Niantic needs to improve Pokemon Go for the better. And there's a lot of little things that they could do to improve that game drastically. So I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe if it's your first time here. And without further ado, let's talk about Harry Potter Wizards Unite. Take a look at this tweet from Prodigy's Nation. I think it really encompasses everything that I'm going to be talking about in this video. Basically what he found is that certain inns, which are the Pokestop equivalent in Harry Potter Wizards Unite, will actually give out more to rural players so that they can keep up with urban players. One of the big problems in Pokemon Go is that rural players seldom have the opportunity to keep up with urban players, and a lot of that has to do with the fact that there just isn't that many Pokestops and gyms in rural areas. One of the suggestions that the community has been making is that for Pokestops that are in rural areas, just simply have them give out more items. This would give rural players a lot more of an edge so that they could keep up with urban players. But it looks like Niantic decided to save that sort of mechanic for Harry Potter Wizards Unite as opposed to Pokemon Go. It's quite infuriating. This is just one example of how Harry Potter Wizards Unite has certain mechanics that really would benefit Pokemon Go, but for one reason or another, it's not in Pokemon Go. Another thing that I observed personally with Harry Potter Wizards Unite is that it uses the latest OSM data, something that Pokemon Go has not had for a long time. I mean, the fact that there are certain inns and parks that are available in Harry Potter Wizards Unite that you do not see reflected in Pokemon Go, I mean, that could be really frustrating for people who live in suburban and rural areas. Something that's really disheartening is that you open up Pokemon Go and see barely any gyms and Pokestops in your location, and then you open up Wizards Unite and you see a whole bunch more inns and fortresses and a whole bunch of other points of interest in that exact same location. Now another thing that Wizards Unite does that Pokemon Go does not is the fact that at big points of interest locations like fortresses, there's just a lot of different things you could do inside there. It really feels like an activity center. There's just a whole bunch of stuff to do when you're inside a fortress or an inn. There's something really special about having little mini games inside each of these locations. When you're at a point of interest, it gives you something to do aside from just collecting confoundables. I would personally love to see something like 
like this. As much as I think gym battling is fun, it really is limited gameplay. There really isn't a whole much you can do inside a gym aside from claiming it or defending it or doing raid battles. I would love to see some little mini games added into gyms so that players have a lot more to do if they're sitting under a gym. It makes these locations a lot more valuable, it gives a lot more depth to them. I would love to see something like that added into Pokemon Go. Now this last thing may not necessarily be that frustrating for a lot of players, but for me it did bother me quite a lot. I do not like the fact that Harry Potter Wizards Unite has voiceover work, whereas Pokemon Go does not. We've got to return what is lost, and quickly. The Statute of Secrecy is in danger of being broken. Harry Potter, an Auror from the Department of Magical Law Enforcement, is on hand to advise you on a few calamity basics. Hello. Thanks for volunteering your help to the Ministry. I'm Harry Potter. Let's get started. I don't think it's necessarily that much more difficult to add voiceover to Pokemon Go. I mean, we've already seen YouTube videos that Niantic has created with Professor Willow's voice. So you know there are voice actors that could voice these characters, and I think it's just one little level of polish that could go a long way. Actually, Professor, it's a special one. You see, there's something very important about- oh. Another thing that really frustrates me as a Pokemon Go player is the fact that Wizards Unite has a much better combat system. There's a lot of complexity to it, there's a lot of strategy to it, and it's something that I see missing in Pokemon Go's PvP and gym battles. Now I totally understand that a lot of people enjoy PvP in Pokemon Go, it does have a lot of beauty and its simplicity, but I do feel like it's a lot less engaging than Harry Potter Wizards Unite's combat system. Now I totally understand that they can't really do too much more to PvP to improve it, and I, again, a lot of people do find it to be a lot of fun, but I do think that Harry Potter Wizards Unite shows how much better Niantic could do when it comes to systems like these. Now I can totally understand that Harry Potter Wizards Unite is not a perfect game. There are certainly things that Pokemon Go does that Harry Potter does not, and it makes Pokemon Go a better game. I like the fact that Pokemon Go is a lot more simple, it's not as complex, there is definitely a sense of convolutedness in Harry Potter Wizards Unite. But it's not necessarily about the core gameplay that I have an issue with. It's a lot to do with the fact that Harry Potter Wizards Unite does a lot more for rural players than Pokemon Go does, even though Pokemon Go has been out for much longer. Something that I would love to see for both Pokemon Go and Wizards Unite is a sense of consistency. I would love to see Pokemon Go get a lot more updates regarding its map as well as a lot of the Pokestops and gyms that it sorely needs. So what exactly am I saying here? Well, basically, Wizards Unite is a lot more friendly to rural and suburban players than Pokemon Go is, and I think that's really concerning, mainly because Pokemon Go is a much bigger game. As much as I love Harry Potter Wizards Unite, I really think the priority should still be on Pokemon Go. I would hate the idea of Niantic disregarding Pokemon Go for the sake of Harry Potter Wizards Unite. As much fun as Harry Potter Wizards Unite is, it's not as big, nor will it ever be as big as Pokemon Go. And I really think for all of the people who are playing Pokemon Go, a lot of their needs need to be met. But I think the silver lining here is the fact that a lot of what we're seeing in Wizards Unite that could be in Pokemon Go can be implemented into Pokemon Go. It shows that Niantic has the capacity to put this stuff in. As much as Pokemon Go is essentially feature complete with the addition of PvP, I really think there's a lot of little things that could drastically improve Pokemon Go. On top of just simply adding a lot more points of interest and a lot more Pokestops and gyms, I would love to see them implement a lot of different building types, like if we could have Pokemon Centers or Breeding Centers, that would be really cool. The fact that we're seeing something like this in Harry Potter Wizards Unite is really awesome. I love the fact that there's a lot of different building types in Harry Potter Wizards Wizards Unite with a lot of different activities. I would love to see something like that implemented in Pokemon Go. And I do love seeing stuff like professions and talent systems in Harry Potter Wizards Unite. I think as much as that stuff could make the game a lot more convoluted, I like that kind of complexity in my games and for as hardcore as Pokemon Go could potentially be, having stuff like this in Pokemon Go would be really awesome. If you think about professions and specializations, it adds another level of depth to the characterization of your trainer. And I really like the idea of you having a specialization. Like 
like if you are a dragon type specialization you could have bonuses to your dragon types or maybe you are a collector and you get a lot more rare spawns depending on how far your profession is different things like that i think would go a long way and yes, like I said, I do think Niantic is focusing on their new thing and it's totally understandable why they would do that. It makes sense from a business standpoint, but I really hope Niantic is not ignoring the community desires and the community feedback when it comes to Pokemon Go. We would love to see a lot of this stuff implemented into Pokemon Go. I think it could make it a much better game than it currently is. And I do think Pokemon Go is in a good place. Let's say they never implement any of this stuff. It would still be a great game. But for a lot of reasons and for a lot of different players, I really think Niantic should implement a lot of the stuff that they have in Harry Potter Wizards Unite into Pokemon Go. So ultimately, let me close with this. Both Pokemon Go and Harry Potter Wizards Unite are phenomenal games. I really like the fact that both of these games are polished and just full of a lot of fun and activity. But what I would really like to see is consistency. There's a lot of things that Harry Potter Wizards Unite does that Pokemon Go does not, and I really wish that a lot of these mechanics were in Pokemon Go. I think it's owed to rural players, suburban players, and yes, even urban players to have have a lot of these mechanics in Pokemon Go. The fact that Harry Potter Wizards Unite has a much better experience for rural players than Pokemon Go does is a bit of a travesty considering that Pokemon Go's rural community has been crying out for a lot of improvements for such a long time. I really hope Niantic considers this and does a lot of improvements to Pokemon Go. So there you have it everyone, I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button, subscribe if it's your first time here, and let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. Do you think Harry Potter Wizards Unite could vastly improve Pokemon Go? I would love to know your thoughts. Let's have a great discussion, that's the whole point of these video essays. And yeah, hope you enjoyed it, I am Count Jinsula, and I'll catch you all later.